nigga like a perky nigga You need surgery nigga kicking dose That's that perky nigga was preferred nigga what Alright, so we back with the Phoenix Suns, my GM. Check out the, the Lakers that I just started. If y'all ain't see that, I'm doing a Lakers one now. Also, I just started up a online association with like 10, it's like 9 or 10 people in it. Um, Me and my homies playing in it. If y'all want to see footage of that, I'm going to be playing. Of course, we're going to be playing against computer. But we also be playing against each other. It's a fantasy draft with classic and current nba team so like my team got rip hamilton the 24 year old mellow i got steve now you know what i'm saying like it's like it's a mixture of players and it's a fantasy draft y'all want to see that i'm gonna show that if not i'm probably gonna show that anyway but um it's like an association really it's just it ain't like this it's, it's not it has nothing to do with like balancing salaries it's just playing so if y'all want to see that i'll show that but let's go ahead and um Let's get right into this episode. I mean, what, what, what? I forgot what I did in the last episode. Honestly, I had to watch my old video. I know I'll talk about doing trades. Um, we need him to be gone. Actually, we don't need him to be gone, but I feel like it's just not a, a, a play for him on the team anymore, honestly. And I think his trade bait should be somewhat decent. Um, the reason why I say we don't need him anymore because I, I like Marquise Chris better. Uh, I don't know if his potential is higher, but honestly, Marquise Chris to me is a better player. They have, I think, they have basically the same amount of potential, and uh, yeah, same amount of potential. They're the same overall, basically at the same time. I think Chris is not. Yeah, he's loyal, so he ain't gonna leave. And we also got Marvin Bagley now, so there is not a need from on this team for our, uh, Bender, so he can leave. Um, pretty much. Pretty much, I don't know if I should go for a draft pick, and I don't know how I'm gonna get this man off the team. I was trying to just package him off, you know what I'm saying? You get Bender, a young piece, and then Brandon Knight, a decent point guard. Um, the 76ers obviously would not need this trade, but like I'm saying, like I don't know what I would do with Brandon Knight. I think Brandon Knight throws this shit off. I keep getting this trade, man. I've gotten this trade so many times, and I don't know if this. You know what I'm saying? Like, Brent Bender, Jordan Clarkson, I'll have to give up some cash. I don't know, like, if I really want to just, you know what I'm saying? I don't in real life. In real life, Jordan Clarkson is a villain for trade, but he's not on the Bulls in real life either. Um, So, I mean, like, I mean, like, I don't know if I can be realistic. Realistically speaking, he, he does have a place on the team. Technically, he can be the starting point guard. A second round 2020th pick which honestly I don't know if that's fair so I will probably go ahead and give them a 19 pick from the Pelicans as well um because actually I think in real life I don't think that's a bad trade to be honest with y'all because Clarkson's contract I'm not like I said I'm not trying to cheat I'm not trying to cheat it's gonna pop up again to you it's not to you it was um Bender Knight Bender's contract is pretty high, but so is Clarkson. So it's kind of like they kind of counter each other. I think Pritch is going to pop up again. Yeah, it's going to pop up again. Uh, we got a one year contract. And I think he's probably gone. He's just team off just so I can bring him back if I want to. And then two years of him, 14 50. So I do actually gain some cap back. Would, I would have to upgrade the picks, though. Like I would give them, I get him my, my uh, 2019 second round pick. Now they're not interested. Now they want the whole. Fu nah, see, this is why. This is this is why this thing is broken. Like I had a whole, had a whole, I had a whole plan, and now they want to give me Bobby Porter on top of that. That's dumb. Like never mind. Fuck it. Fuck it. Just fuck it. A little bit. See what happens to uh, to the Spurs. We're having a very 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 bad season. This is actually not too bad, but I don't want Devin Booker to leave. Um. I want Devin Booker to stay this is his contract season. Galloway, no, good on that one. But I don't know what's gonna happen. Hopefully, hopefully, like even if he tests his free agency, dude, this nigga Marvin Bagley, damn, for six to eight weeks. Oh, uh, we also got um the Heat's pick this season. So I think the Heat, like no, no matter what, no matter what, we got the Heat's pick. We're ass is. Fuck this year. We were better last year. Like, I thought we would have been better this year, but we're, I was wrong. We got the Heat's pick. 
And if the Heat are doing bad, we get they they get we're gonna have a decent little pick coming our way. Where's the Heat? The Heat, I think. Nah, this is our pick, and the Heat. The Heat will be cold this season. I hate this game, bro. The Heat is never this cold. Maybe I can trade trade away Gordon uh, Drogen Bender for a uh, first round draft pick, cause I don't really need. Uh, I don't need him. What team needs a power for? Like a power, a decent power for Grizzlies maybe. Miratek, they just got Miratek, and then uh, who else they got? Miratek. Maybe Memphis. They don't have a first round pick, man. Who who got a first round pick? Hawks need a power for it, man. The Hawks definitely need a power for it. First round pick. We got the Cavaliers, top 10 protected. I don't think Cavs, the Cavs should not be nowhere near that. So let me just check real quick. Conference, East. Cleveland is right there, yeah. Um, We should probably just go for the, the Cavaliers pick. If they, that's probably what, they'll probably let us have it. To be honest with y'all, the Hawks. Um unprotected they, they won't go for this they won't go for this i'm already knowing yeah no they would they wouldn't go for this they, they would definitely give me the um the cavaliers pick though and then if i gave them do they got enough cap space though no they ain't got enough cap space that's tough they need to give me about four mil back i don't know if i need if they gonna adjust to the nah what another another dead end trade this is this is crazy got too many bigs my aaron gordon and then who's coming off the bench nobody at power four let's go with the magic propose a trade to the magic for their pick please have their first round pick they do have their first round pick unprotected damn they ain't gonna fall for this yeah no nah, i'm not throwing a pick or something um Nah, they went down. They got enough cap space. They should have. They should have the cap. They should have the cap. Negative seven. How do they have negative seven million? Is it because of this year they have negative seven million? Like what the hell? This would have worked too. Hold on, let's try to make something happen. And just give me like I don't know, man. Who? Can I get Tyus Battle? Ah, uh, nah, he's a top prospect. Let's give me like the real Arthur. Swap bigs. This will work. Oh, they ain't have enough. They had enough people. What's the real Arthur contract? So then we'll get seven mil. So we're just taking seven mil for this season. Um, they're getting four mil, and they can resign him if they want to. And we're getting a first round pick from the Mavs. They don't want that because they want Devon Reed. That, whatever. I don't want all these people. This game and these trades is dumb. Even when I'm trying to just do a trade straight up. Like, why? Why? No, I don't want five people from your team, bro. Nobody wants him. Just nobody wants him or needs him. So I get some offers, maybe. I don't know, man. We're, we're losing bad. Losing bad. Like, really bad. And I can't even get a trade. Nobody wants Bender. I guess the league just don't want him. There's not a need for it for George and Bender. But damn sure ain't gonna be able to trade away what's the name so i might as well just finish out this season and uh let what's the name nunless noel and reed no i, I, I want to keep nunless noel i'm trying to keep as much money as possible because um i remember the free agency class last the on the last uh off season was terrible everybody wants they just sent me a, two trades back to back this damn trade system is dumb Marquise Chris, Chris Middleton. Ooh. He's still undecided. He will resign. No need to resign him. I have a team option on him, don't I still? Yeah. I'm not signing you back. Will we sign? I don't know if I want to keep Troy Daniels and I'm not signing you back. Oh man, Devin Booker, please make up your mind. You need to come back. Damn. Assume a little, little longer. Probably up to the All-Star game. Call it quits, man. I know we didn't get a lot of done in this episode. I, gee, I tried to do some trades. They, they're going to trade right here. 
what let me did i decline no accident okay so they want the magics they want to give me jonathan simmons a shooting guard who will come off the bench if he comes to my team six years six mil five mil jared dudley bismack biombo that's the catch bismack biombo who has a player option for next year get the fuck out of my face with that decline that trade uh I know it's another, another, <laughs> another dude that got a fat, they got three, three more years of 10, of 15 plus mil, uh, uh, crazy, crazy. Yeah, so we skipped over the trade deadline, man. I couldn't, I tried to look for some more trades, but like I said, I'm going to have to just bite the bullet. I'm not going to resign him back. Um, I tried to do some trades. Nobody really wanted him. I didn't want to cheat the system. And I'll just let him go, I guess. Let him walk. I'm not going to sign him back. So it's going to be five mil coming from him. Nine mil that I'm not going to give to him. I might give Daniels a contract. Um, maybe maybe a small little contract. Um, I don't really want Devon Reed or Devin Reed. How the fuck you would say his name? So, uh, what he got? He got what? Like, I'm not gonna spring him back either. No, he got a team option. I don't know if I'm bringing him back either. So, uh, we got some people that's gonna be leaving, giving us some more money. This free agency class, man, we got a splash. Do we have upcoming free agents yet? Can we see the upcoming free agents? We gotta, we gotta make a splash. We got Cat. We got Ben Simmons, who's gonna go back. Yeah, he has a team option. Cat, who's not a. Is he? He's probably gonna go back, though. He's loyal, loyal dude. Uh, man. Maybe Marcus. Nah, Marcus. Uh, Kimba. That point guard take us over the hump. Might go for Kimba. Devin Booker is better. He better come back. Jason Tatum is probably gonna stay. Maybe, maybe, but now we don't need a Brogdon. Who else? Harrison Barnes, maybe. No, I don't need Harrison Barnes. Really, we need a, a um, maybe a top tier big. Maybe Mark Gasol, Cat, Kimba. Maybe Kimba. I think I might go for Kimba, man. Kimba might have to be the dude. Maybe De'Aaron Fox, if he don't sign back. You know what I'm saying? A point guard, maybe. We'll see what happens.